Hey guys, welcome back to Battle Cats. Today, we are gonna play Battle Cats without using cats. In this video, cats are illegal. So what I did guys is I went through every single unit I have in this game and I favorited all the ones that aren't cats. And I was very strict about it. If I saw a cat anywhere in the unit, I did not favorite it, okay? You will not see a single cat face today with like one exception. And I guess that's the cat cannon because you can't actually turn the cat cannon off. I just won't use it, okay? So this should be the full list of all the units in this game that are in no way cats. They're not cats, there are no cats with them, there are no cats to be found. We got Hyper Mister, Princess Punt. I don't even know where these units come from, but I did take a look at them and none of them have cats in them, okay? As you can see right here, the Shackerel uh, units do have cats, but the first form doesn't, okay? So we just gotta put them on the first form, because no cats, please. I'm actually not sure if these special cats are allowed, guys, because I'm pretty sure they do all have cats. Um, with them. So let's just take a quick look at that. Okay. Valkyrie obviously has a cat. This guy's got a cat. Cat God is a cat. Filibuster cat. Jay Gando does not have a cat. How cool is that, guys? There's no, there's no cat here. Do you see a cat here anywhere? I don't see cat ears. I don't see cat face. Good. Because we need, like, something decent in this level. If we go for Lord of Rune, Jay Gando Jr., he has a cat. So that's not allowed. So first form only. Looks like we're actually good on the wolf, which is nice. I don't think any of these forms have a cat on them. I don't know if that's supposed to be a cat or not. It just looks like a demon to me. So we'll 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 allow it. We can use Lil Neandum, but only in the first form because then he gets a cat, and then he gets a you know a bus full of cats. Mina has a cat in her basket, guys. The whole time, no Mina. I think I'm gonna let myself use Doron in the first form because I don't think he's a cat, but he gets a cat mask, and we can't have that. So anyway, you should understand the uh, the rules now, guys. If you see anything else that's actually a cat, it's fine. If it goes in a level and I see a cat face, I'll take it out, okay? Some of these, like I said, they are cats, but they're not. You just need to get the right form of them, all right? It's very important that we don't use any cats. Okay, so what are we gonna do with all these not cats? Well, I thought it might be fun to visit a bunch of chapter three moons first and just see how that goes. So here we go, Empire of Cats chapter three moon. Can we beat the hardest level in Empire of Cats without cats? Empire of what now? Doesn't look like that hard of a level, guys, especially if we have a few good Ubers because the, the highest frequency of non-cats is actually in the Ubers because so many of them are from like different collabs and things. None of the Street Fighters have any cats, which is freaking awesome. Now we need to build a loadout that's good against, I mean, traitless and red and floating, I guess. All right then. Nope, don't wanna use an old formation. I want to put on my favorites only. That's already done. And uh, let's go for red first. Pikataro, you're good against red. 78 year old man, yeah. You can freeze red, guys, that's amazing. That's exactly what I wanted. Anything but these cats. Look at all these cats I can't use, <laughs> oh my god. This guy's lewd. I don't even, I'm not even sure what that means, but it's cool. So far, guys, this is a very weird loadout. I'm gonna go for, um, let's order by cost and see if we can get some like meat shield-ish sort of things in here. Cause we don't really have any cheap units. Beta Kuma, luckily, is cheap. Might knock back aliens, which doesn't matter. That's cool. Get in there. Swordsman Johnny. Doesn't have a lot of levels, but he, he's not a cat, so that's cool. Crystal Lil Gao Gao, though. That could be good, because Crystal Lil Gao Gao is actually a pretty decent unit. Good defense versus black enemies. We don't got any black enemies here, but it's cool. Okay, we're just trying to fill the loadout up. Let's, uh, let's take a look at anti-floating, just to see if there might be something good here. What do you do? Freeze, huh? Okay, all right. I know what I'm using against floating, guys. My girl, Saber. She ain't got no cats, okay? I checked. Hey, maybe we can get an Akuma lion going here, guys. Lions aren't cats. I don't know if he's any good, but most of these things aren't. Shakaro lion's actually kind of cool, guys. He's got a critical hit and a wave attack. I think if I'm gonna go for anything else here, this is actually a really good unit to use. It's just quite effective. We've got two forms, we can use either one. Neither is a cat. 
So this is our loadout. It looks absolutely terrible, but that's the whole point, okay? What can you actually do in this game without cats? I mean, it's called Battle Cats, right? Not today it's not. Today the game is called Battle. Welcome to Battle, guys. Enjoy. Let's go to the moon. Oh man, they coming fast, guys. I don't know how I feel about that. Go, go, help me. Boom. Come on. Boom. You're not doing nothing. Get some more units out here. I think the panda is going to help us the most, besides for Saber, of course. Honestly, if you can meet shield at all, like without cats, which we can kind of do. Beta Kuma's working pretty well as a meat shield here. It's got good, good, uh, you know, recharge or whatever. The, all three of these units I have, um, you know, here that I'm using the most, they're all pretty good for meat shields. Otherwise, we just need to send out a couple of, uh, a couple of Ubers. Now, I'm using the first form of Crazy Yuki, okay? It's not Crazy Yuki and Cat. That would not be appropriate. That would be illegal. Crazy Yuki, though, does have good damage against red and black. I wish she had good damage against floating, but Saber does. So I think Saber's probably going to smoke this guy pretty good. Look at that. Smack, smack, smack. Double sabers. Sometimes you just gotta get double sabers out here, you know what I mean? Huh? Easy. Nothing to it. Wow. I don't even need cats in my Battle Cats game. Should have sent out a Picataro though, guys. I feel like that was a wasted opportunity. I mean, look at this guy. He's definitely not a cat. He has a cat form. But anyway. Sweet. We did it, guys. I can't, I can't believe we actually did it. Okay, maybe I can. But it's gonna get harder. I mean... Chapter 3 of Into the Future is probably going to be significantly more difficult. We might want to get some anti-alien units this time. And no, I don't want to use this! Thank you very much! Look at look at all these cats, guys! Gross! These guys right here, these, these, little, uh, these little dudes, they're all like anti-alien units. Massive damage could be fun. You're not super expensive. Hmm. Long range area damage and weaken versus alien enemies. That sounds freaking... Awesome. Let's uh, let's pop you in here, okay? And I'm gonna give you some levels as well. You're pretty weak. Now I know this is gonna cut into my XP a little bit, guys, but I do have 60 something million XP, and this is a special video, okay? By the way, you should probably smash the like button, okay? I'm just saying, you probably should. I'm giving you like a few seconds to do it. Thank you very much. A Battle Cats video with no cats in it? Nah, that bro, that's an automatic dislike. Can't believe you would do that to me, Matt Shea. Into the future, chapter three. Can we do it? Aren't you good against aliens? No, black. Okay, sorry. You? Anyone good against aliens here? Aliens? Aliens? Yeah. Uh, let's just put some stuff out because nobody wants to die. There we go. And this guy. Yeah. Oh, no! Get that up about the... Ha! Ha! Oh! Did you see that? There was a cat. That was that was disgusting. I can't believe I let that happen. Yeah, not I meant to put ninth angel in, not ninth angel cat. What's wrong with me? You saw nothing. You did not see me commit crimes. Also, I'm not sure if I used my cat cannon last time. I'm gonna assume that I didn't. And uh and I won't. I'm pretty sure all we need is like the first three units here. And this guy. Okay? Take a quick look. There are no cats on this man thing. I don't actually know what it is. Saber, get in there. I love Saber so much, guys. And now she's even better than ever before because she passes the requirements for this video. I don't know what's up with this lewd guy here. Kind of strange. I don't know. I don't know what's up with that. Anyway, that's cool. I don't think Awaken Bahamut's going to be able to hurt us very much, guys. Maybe we get that angel in here. Oh, no, you killed it. Oh, that's not good. Can anybody do wave attacks here? I feel like we're gonna... Oh, I just used my cannon. P pretend I didn't do that, okay? I'm trying my hardest here, guys. Yeah, this is bad. This is bad. Bahamut is killing us, guys. Awaken Bahamut just ended my life. I'm so sad about that. This is only the second level I've played, and I'm already losing. Why aren't you cats? 80? Oh, man. Well, I could just continue and do it that way, or get God to come down and help me out, but that'd be... Cringe and sus. Cringe and sus. We should probably just get some more anti-alien units, honestly. There's probably some... Uh, whoa, nope. Nope, 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 Yep. What about long-range strikes that curse aliens? That sounds like it could be fun. Uh, what does this guy do? Hold on, let me, uh... Okay, I'll take a look. You are... Able to knock back everything. I don't know, man. I want the other thing. 
I feel like I'm gonna have to pour some XP into some of these things, guys. I'm gonna try moose, okay? It's a duck, not a cat, by the way. Long range strike might curse aliens and zombies, so that could be good here. But it's not a super high level, so I'll go ahead and do that. At some point, I'm gonna decide that I don't want to keep, you know, pouring XP into these things. I'm not gonna go for that last level. 29's good enough. That's one and a half million XP I don't really wanna spend. Here we go. Second time's a charm. Awaken Muhammad, or uh, Raging Muhammad, or whatever he is, he's not gonna touch me, okay? Oh, this guy's actually, uh, right. He's a sort of a spammable Uber. That could be fun. Not really sure what the strategy is here, guys, other than, you know, what I'm doing. Save up and get some Ubers would be my best guess for best strat, you know. Uh, oh, did you have to? Because that's going to be kind of complicated. Don't hit it. Don't hit it too hard. Thanks. That's cool. She taking her time. At what point does that... There we go. Okay. So, yeah, you're going to hurt her pretty bad. I should not have used that. I'm sorry. I'm just so used to hitting the space bar. It was, it was not a game-changing move. Okay. And it also didn't happen. Okay, we got an attack off with our, uh, our angel this time, guys. So that's good. Do it again. Boom! Very nice. You might actually be able to uh, lead us to victory if you keep doing that. Or you can die. I might actually need some wave attacks here. There's too much in front. I meant to look for wave attacks and I sort of forgot about it again. So we're going to have to probably do that. Unless we can get this guy. He's strong. He's giving us a hard time, man. Oh, jeez. Why is this game so hard all of a sudden? 50%? If we didn't continue there, we probably could have done it, but let me just take a look. We can order by level. That's a thing. Because then we can go uh, to the end here and see what's actually really good. Hmm. There's There there are some good units in here. We can use Uriel in his first form because he's not a cat. Uh, area attack surge. Like, that could be cool. I really want to use Gigando here, if I'm honest. Let's try that while we're at it. Let's get rid of this lewd guy, because he just, he's just kind of weird. And let's put in Doron. Man, you guys is tough. You're tough. What's going on here? We got Chun-Li and Blanca here as well. Just feels like none of these guys are actually, like, doing much. I, I mean, I can upgrade them to higher levels, which will help. I feel like just having more Ubers is the best thing here. The first three units are obviously doing good for the meat shielding. But then, yeah, I'm trying to figure out what else we should bring. I'm just gonna throw out one panda and let him uh, kill until he dies. So these guys will be able to hit the base for a while. It takes it takes a bit to get this base down. They're, they're, they're doing a decent amount of damage. Okay. Uh, just gonna just gonna go for it, I guess. Here we go, Blanca! Look at this guy go, man. Boom! He died. That was so sad. That was the worst thing I've ever seen. This this guy just kills everybody. You know? Wow, I, I, I think I'm getting worse. I think it's actually, it's just going worse as time goes on. I don't actually want to lose this stage. I'd like to be able to beat it. We could always take the anti-floating route. Again, sort by level, see what our highest anti-floating units are. Something like this might actually be good here. Okay, here's what we're gonna try now. The Street Fighters are gone again. We have Awakened Uru Run. I've taken a look at this unit. I do not see any cats. We also have Madoka Kaname because of the fact that she's got strong versus floating with long range, slow area attack. So that's, that's, could be good, man. Could be a good time. Okay, so we got the wolf and we got the, oh, the lady with the bow and arrow. That's who that is. I don't know how that's gonna go, but at least everybody's at the base now. We haven't put out Saber and the other guy yet either, so. Meat shield away, boys. We're gonna do this. We slowed him. We actually managed to do that, which is nice. Uh, is he strengthened now? No, somebody else is strengthened. Thankfully. We need we need Saber, guys. Because if we can, like, combo the slowing with Saber, maybe we can pull this off. Come on. Oh, I just don't have anything left, man. Okay, hang on, hang on. Looking a little bit better now. That was cool, whatever just happened. Surge it, baby. Surge it. Okay, okay, okay. Ooh. I don't know, I don't know, guys. Oh, it was close. We're continuing. We're gonna continue this. We're going to beat it and move on. Okay, 
Okay, so now we get all of the things. Almost all of the things. Pretty close to all of the things. There we go. Okay, we, had, we need a little cat food for this one, guys. It, it was cat food, but it wasn't a cat. Okay? We didn't get any help from a cat. My cat cannon has not been fired. Okay? I wanted to fire my cat cannon as in tell it it doesn't have a job anymore, but I'm not allowed. Okay. That was really difficult. That's not, this is not, it's not very feasible to not use cats on something like that. Which means Cats of the Cosmos Chapter 3 is going to be way worse. I will try it. I don't have any hope of us actually beating it. And then we'll try like some uh, Cataman stages as well. Because those could be fun. Here we go, the Big Bang! The Big Bang! That can't, that can't possibly be a really difficult level. Oh, wait a minute. Yeah, we're so doomed, man. So doomed. I don't even know if we can do enough damage to get through this this thing here. I'm gonna try, obviously. Ugh, you? Nope. Okay, that's bad. No, that's cool. Just go ahead and go ahead and murder me. That's uh that's awesome. I will check and see if we have a barrier breaker in our favorites. If not, this level is a total write-off. Barrier breaker, favorites. Okay, we have a couple here. That's good. So uh, I guess Shackerel Tiger is gonna be going in here. Uh, there's a couple other things, like M. Bison might be nice. Although, at the end of the day, it's only gonna do so much, right? Okay, well, we'll, we'll, we'll put this guy in, we'll see how it goes. Uh, it doesn't really matter what we replace, I guess. Try that. You know what I should probably do? I should probably get Pico Taro out of my loadout. Like, why is he, why is he here? You think maybe I might have done a little better in the last level if I didn't keep this loser in my loadout? Possibly. Yeah. Yeah, technically, maybe. We do need to be very anti-alien in this one, guys. Here you go. Let me break that barrier, please. Break it. 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 There we go. Nice job. Probably a big help, to be honest. We need, uh... We need this, this thing to come out. Oh, you're too tough. You're too, it's just, it hurts too much. Okay. Oh, there's just like, there's no power here. We just don't have any power. <laughs> oh man. Massive damage to aliens. That sounds pretty good. How about we try mint over here? Got to keep this guy. I think the, the lion can go. Um, yeah, so it's been fun to see how this would work out without any cats whatsoever, but I'm quickly realizing that most of the good units in this game are actually cats. I mean, I already knew that, but still. Okay, so this, spam all the good units. We, we couldn't even like hurt this thing. We couldn't even kill this thing last time, which is really sad. The knockback might be helping. Where's our money though, man? I feel like I feel like we need money, but then again, if we're not killing anything, of course we're not getting any. Yeah, no, this is so bad. This is like ridiculously bad. I, for some reason, I don't want to give up, even though I know it's impossible to beat this level. I'm gonna try one more thing. I'm gonna put a rich cat on. By the way, guys, I tried to do uh, Infernal Tower 41 to 50. I couldn't get past 41, so I was like, you know what? That's that's obviously not happening. I'm sorry. Eventually it will, it's just, it's not in the cards right now. I think like our best strat right here is this guy because he's like a good, strong, anti-alien uber. We need to kill like one thing. If we can kill like one thing, we'll be in better shape. There we go, okay, so you come out now, start shooting that stuff, please. Again, I don't know why I'm doing this because I know that God is gonna kill me, but whatever, it's fun. Yeah, we finally got to a point where God is here, guys. I uh, I don't know how much damage he's gonna do to us, though. Didn't seem like he did all that much. Stomping his foot. It might hurt me. Well, yeah, okay, so these penguins. These penguins are uh, punishing me. I deserve it. Yeah, okay, this level's way too hard for a no-cat loadout. Cool. But at least we got, we got past uh, into the future, right? So in that case, guys, let's try some Cataman stages. What can we actually do? Let's try an XP stage first, perhaps. We'll do an Expert Sweet XP. Uh, I have a lot of Cataman A, so that's cool. We'll bring a loadout that we have, because it's like pretty much all the good units, you know? Like I, a couple of the Ubers can be switched around, especially like if I brought in um, Akuma. 
for traitless. That could help a lot, but maybe a level like this. An expert, we can probably beat an expert level, right? Probably, maybe. Looks pretty good so far, but then we do have a lot of black units. But also, Crystal Gao Gao is anti-black. So it's kind of like the best case scenario for Crystal Gao Gao. This is a unit I actually got pretty recently, guys. I was surprised it had a true form, and I was surprised that it's actually kind of useful. Most of the units in these collabs are not. Okay, so we were able to beat an expert stage really easily, so that's good. That was a difficulty of six. So let's look for a seven difficulty, see if we can do that. We're just gonna see how high we can go. Dimension of despair. Black hole rising. Insane. What's in here though? I don't remember, I don't remember what's in here. It's fine. We'll just go ahead and beat it. So this is seven stars, okay? Uh, okay, so. Gotta level up here. That's just gonna rip through everything. Like, what am I gonna do about that? I don't think I can do anything, really. Besides for Ubers. Otherwise, like, I don't have anything. When you have a highly specialized unit like this, limiting yourself to no cats, great way to lose. You can do, like, some damage. You weakened him. But, death. Well, I'm gonna I'm gonna bring in every anti like we, we got it to 82% which is not great But there could be some good anti alien units in here for this purpose We'll leave in massive damage to aliens. That sounds like it could be pretty good here We don't need a barrier breaker this one uh, might slow a single enemy slowing the cyclone Obviously is a really great idea, but we'll probably not even be able to get close enough to do it Holy Phoenix has a chance to freeze but like it's at level five. I haven't even gotten the second form of it. Only Phoenix War, and it has a true form as well that I could get. True form evolution gains big changes to its abilities, including strong versus floating, alien and black enemy. Okay, okay. I just need to. I just need to make sure you don't have any cats. But we'll get you first, okay? Because I actually, I'm very curious now. New unit to to true form, just because we can. Got all this stuff. And just do it. Interesting looking unit. Kind of an eyesore, just like uh, Black Zeus, but that's cool. Hang on a second. Where's Yamato? Where is Yamato at? Because Yamato is, uh, he doesn't have a cat. No units matching. Because I got my favorites on? Here he is. I didn't have him favorited, guys, but he got massive area damage to aliens and zombies, so we putting him in. Okay, so we got the uh, rampaging Yamato, and we have head Rococo. I don't know. I don't know what that is. I didn't even realize this was an Uber. I probably should have realized that, but I didn't. Okay. Um, so yeah, strong versus uh, versus floating, and it can freeze them. So that could actually be really good against the cyclone. I don't want to try this too much because it's going to eat up my catamans. I've actually tried Yamato in some levels before, guys. I don't know if he's actually very good in general, but he's very fun to watch. He really is on a rampage here. It's beautiful. Okay, so what happens when he hits that? He don't. He don't hit it. Okay, well, here comes our Uber. Oh, it's got long range, guys. Only problem is I need, like, I think... I, oh, there we go. That was very nice. I think I need Uru Run to help with the knockback, but this is actually working. Until the Uber dies, of course. But we're doing some damage. Kind of nice. Not gonna lie. Okay, our Uber died. If we could pair that with the uh, Awakened Uru Run, maybe the other guy as well, could be all right. 76%, that's not great. I'm gonna buy some rich cats, okay? I'm dropping stacks of cat food on this video. Not really, I'm, I'm spending a little bit. You smash the like button, so it's cool. Obviously, guys, you could say this is a very pointless video, but I thought it'd be fun. I was curious what would happen. It's a bit of a disaster, to be honest. So, biggest part is not dying, right? You gotta freeze, got a little knockback here. Keep it up. You have to control this thing. If you don't control it, it's gonna control you, okay? You gotta freeze it. There we go. Freeze it and kill it. You gotta freeze it and kill it. This knockback could be huge because what's happening is eventually it gets too close to us and then our Uber dies. That is what happened in the last attempt. But with a knockback, that pretty much mostly eliminates that scenario where it gets too close. 
which means everybody stays alive and kills until it dies. We're actually gonna do this. We're gonna beat a seven star level without cats. You think we can do an eight star? I kind of don't, but I didn't think we we're gonna be able to beat this one either, and it's it's going. Uh-oh. Okay, it had to go and get strong, didn't it? It's so rude. Why would you do that? I'm gonna get another Uber, so just, just warning you. I wanna send out both of these at the same time, okay? I want this one and this one. There, go. This is it. This is all you need. We're gonna do it. Stab it. Kill it. Come on. It's weak. It's strong. You can't tell me that wasn't ridiculously close. <laughs> Not cool. I, I should just say yes so that I don't have to spend another rich cat, but that's insulting. We can't have it. Why not just wait? There's no rush. If we can actually like continuously knock this thing back, then we're good. Now I can have one, two, three Ubers. If this doesn't work, I'm gonna get another Uber. And I'm also gonna put the uh, cat CPU on now. We should be able to let it just, let it ride, you know? Let it ride. Beautiful. Excellent, yeah, I love it. Yeah, Yamato's even getting some attacks in, guys, and he usually dies really fast. He's really not very good at this. That's it, that's it. Kill it! It's so close to being dead. It's, uh, it's strengthened, and then it gets weakened, which I think is a really good thing when you can weaken something that's strong. Boom, it's done. Because, yeah, if, if something is strengthened, and then you weaken it, I'm pretty sure you bring the damage down by a lot, because it goes from strong to weak, instead of strong to normal or whatever, you know? I'm not sure. Because I don't know all the things. I don't sit there and like read all the stats about all the things in Battle Cats. I just, I just play the game and things happen. I'm actually really happy about this, man. I really had to think outside the box on this one, sort of, maybe. I had to get another Uber. Now I have another level 30 Uber. I don't have enough of those, to be honest, because it's just expensive. And most Ubers, I'm like, whatever. Got a first clear reward on that, so that's kind of cool. I could have done the continue, but then I would have uh, I would have just spent the cat food that I would have got for the clear reward. And I got a leadership. Life is good. Now, we have XP Mega Blitz right here, guys. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Now this is another black stage. This one's actually, oh. I don't think this is the one that's tough. It's actually uh, the merciless one that's, that's really tough. Um, that has a very similar setup. I think we should be good. Might want to pop back in a couple of anti-black units that I might have taken out. Let's put Judgment in. Judgment has a uh, chance to slow black enemies. Crazy Yuki is always a good time because it kills black enemies really good. We got Ranma over here, guys. Freezes black enemies and angels, long range area. Let's try that. Oh, and the fourth, the fourth angel, guys. Massive area damage and knockback versus black enemies. Should we do it? Oh, I'm thinking we should. I'm thinking that'd be kind of cool. Just, just to level 20, uh, 29 plus three, okay? Yeah, that was like four million XP spent right there. I hope this doesn't hurt you too bad to see. I don't really want to take Mint out, just because I like, I like the the range on the attack, but it's, it's not going to be super useful here. Uh, I, I, I think we might be good on this. Let's give this a shot. I don't want a rich cat. I'll take the cat CPU because they're probably going to get a bunch of money. Okay, this is. Not, it's not the nicest unit in the game, man. I'm gonna tell you right now. He's kind of a jerk. Although it seems like he's not doing that much damage to us. Well, that's good. Uber carry is definitely gonna be a thing in this. Here comes Uber number one. I actually really like this one, guys. I just, I like watching her float around. Uh, okay, there we go. That's good. Things are dying. I want to get the thing here in and boom. Okay, nice. I've said this a lot, but I think that um, black enemies in this game are kind of like really underpowered like later in the game. Like I'm never threatened by black enemies unless there are other things around as well. Like look at that. Like an eight star. Oh God, that's right. There's more to this. Here, CPU time. I think we can pull this off just because that freeze is like really good. And we got this angel up here, which is gonna do a little thing with his hand. 
You can't even really see it, but it's working. Yeah, we're fine. We're fine, man. It's beautiful. I could do this all day. Who said I needed cats? I don't need cats. I'm gonna put my cats up for adoption, guys. I didn't realize they were so uh, useless, you know? All right, I got some XP, because it's an XP stage. Good. Clional Ascendant. Oh. Oh, I, oh, I, oh. I don't think, I don't think we can. Uh, Sleipnir is way too strong, but that being said, I will take a look at my anti-angel favorites. Omni Strike damage and freeze versus angelic enemies. That definitely got to go in. You, not angels. Oh, I don't think we're going to be able to use you. Sorry. Maybe we can like stick in both of the uh, wolves and just hope that they can keep things under control. I mean, I have a few Ubers here. It's just... Sleipnir is just such a jerk, guys. I really do not like Sleipnir. Speaking of things I don't like, how are you doing? Like, this is gonna be so bad. Like, we're just gonna get absolutely roasted here. Beta Kuma can't even do nothing. Yeah, that's not gonna work out, guys. Not a chance in hell. Maybe with a big old angel here? Oh, no. Oh, they are so close to the base, guys. They are hurting the base. The angel died. Rip. Th there's no way. There is no way. Mm-mm. 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 Angels are hard enough to go against when you have cats. How about this, guys? I'll take the loadout I just used to beat Refined Palette, and I'll try and beat an even harder stage. Because black enemies, we seem to do pretty well with better than other things, which is just the case whether you're using cats or not. So yeah, let's go to XP Coliseum. This is a deadly stage, Tempered in Flame. But it is just a bunch of black enemies, so there's a chance we'll do it. Hey, look, Beta Kuma wants to be friends. And he died. Rip, bro. Okay, yeah, we need to, we need to protect ourselves a little bit here because that's a lot of dogs coming at us. Not bad though, I mean, the meat shields, they, they're gonna die in one hit anyway, so that's like, it's fine. Uh, let's get you out. It's fun when you have the uh, the cat version of this because it actually brings out a bun bun, shoots a, a, like a black bun bun shoots at them. But no, because that's a cat form. We don't want that. I told you guys, black enemies, they're, they're built different in a bad way, okay? Okay, things have turned around now. I don't feel good anymore. Probably could have used like a rich cat or something here. I think I might actually try that because if we had you know, more things to attack with. We might have actually survived this. I can't get an Uber right now, so we done. Would be cool to see me beat this level though without without any cats, so yeah, let's try it. 85%, we didn't do that great there, but that's cool. It really doesn't take much to get like a whole lot more percent. You just need to do like a little bit better. See, the Ubers that have these uh, abilities like freezing and slowing, they're obviously a huge help in a situation like this. Cause like we're under power, we don't have the DPS for the most part, so we have to rely on some stuff like that to get us through. Although if we have DPS for anything, it is black units. Yeah, this is going this is going really well. Let's go ahead and put the cat CPU on and just watch it happen. Well, we managed to kill the guy in the chair. Neandum is dead, so that's cool. But we do have a whole bunch of uh, seahorses. That's bad. We're working on them. I think we're I think we're slowly getting them, but the seahorses are really damaging our back line because that's what they do. Hmm. So we're hitting the base, and we're very low on money. And I feel like I need to step in here and do something. So it, we just have to we just have to stall until we get a good Uber again. Okay, things are dying. That freaking panda, man. That panda is such a carry right now. Look at him go. Just kicking everything to death. I love it. I thought I was going to need another Uber here. Apparently, I don't need another Uber here. But I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to give myself one anyway. Okay. So there you go. We managed to do it. Okay. I'm curious, guys. I want to try an anti-red loadout. So I'm not sure if I have a lot of anti-red units. So let's see if we do. We'll see how many of these... Uh, 
growing red stages we can beat. Yeah, like I have nothing that's actually high level that's anti-red. So like, probably not a big deal for like the beginning, but if the levels get any harder, we're not gonna have any DPS. Female Ranma though, huh? Luke. Luke is strong against traded enemies, so he's actually something we could probably bring into a lot of different stages. So, gotta replace something, maybe this guy. I am very, very, very uber heavy here. But again, that's pretty much all you can do when you don't have cats. You have to just rely on a few really good ubers and hope the meat shields can do the trick. This is the, this is the easiest of the red stages. It's just a hard stage, it should be no problem for us to beat it. Here comes our boy, Luke. I don't even know who this guy is. He wasn't in my Street Fighter game, but that's fine. Yeah, look at look at all these, man. Look at all these Ubers. We got the Street Fighters. Street Fighters are a big help, man, because like I said, none of them are cats. Boom. Not surprised to beat that one, but can we beat the next one? Starts off with a seal. You are just anti-alien. I probably don't even need you here. I'm just gonna try and kill the seal with the panda. Didn't do it. Someone else got him instead. And here comes Luke. Boom. I actually kind of like this guy. Look at that. Wham! He just goes over and goes, boom! And things die. But can he go boom against a red bun bun? Well, I bet he could turn your bun buns red if he really wanted to, okay? Okay, looks pretty good to me. Luke is alive. He's still bringing the smack down. The end. All right, got a red cat fruit. Doesn't matter, I definitely wouldn't spend three catamans on a red cat fruit, but that's cool. Here we go, red passion's insane. So tempted to just throw Luke in there and watch him shred because he shreds. I got new respect for this guy. Wham! 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 Oh, you didn't kill it. Wham! You just still didn't kill it. How many whams do you need? Five. He needed five whams, guys. Look at this guy go. Absolutely poggers, but look at that. So now we definitely want to rely on our Ubers. We could have even got more of those out. Luke is dead. We could have supported him better. We didn't. We didn't do that. Look, if you got enough power, you can take out a boar. Two boars, though? Don't know about two boars. Here goes one boar, so that's nice. We might be all right. Chun-Li. Chun-Li's knockback, I think, is, is doing something here now. So she is knockback against red, black, and aliens, and she attacks really fast. I think that might be what's helping her get so many knockbacks. But yeah, that thing is constantly bouncing off her foot. Beautiful. And it's gone. Okay. I think that was the last stage, right? Yeah. So what did we learn today, folks? I guess we learned that uh, Battle Cats is easier when you have cats. And it's a lot more difficult when you don't. <laughs> wow. Obviously, I already knew that coming into this video, but uh, it was a fun experiment anyway. So I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, please hit that like button. And if you have other challenges for me, just leave them down below in the comments. Thank you so much for watching. And if you wanna check out another one of my videos, you can click right there. You better do it soon though.